And now, as I understand, you're going to show us how to do uh, this treatment for yourself at home? Yes. Yes, I will. Um, and as a general note, um, even if you are doing fecal transplants with the guidance and assistance of a doctor, in most cases, you will still have to do follow-up uh, enemas at home. Uh, this is due to considerations of uh, a doctor's time and, and cost and access to equipment like a colonoscope. You can't always schedule those for every single day. And so the good news is that there's research to support that when um, enemas are done correctly, uh, simple low volume enemas that you can do at home uh, can help you get the same successful results. And also in some places, it may not be possible to find a doctor willing to do these uh, due to liability concerns and restrictions from the Food and Drug Administration. So doing them yourself might be the only way to save someone's life in the case of deadly uh, C. diff related colitis and maybe the only way to save your colon if you have ulcerative colitis. Looking forward to that presentation. Uh, we'll be right back after this break to watch Michael's demonstration.